Hi, I'm Brian, Brian Moe from uh, Brian Moe Shrub and Door Restaurant in Glasgow. Um, today I've teamed up with the guys uh, Fish is the Dish and Morrison's on their See for Yourself campaign, which is all about highlighting the amazing fish caught right here in the UK. Um, I've got this brilliant fish box uh, from my local Morrison's uh, this morning. It's packed full of seafood, including sole, place, mackerel, herring, and sardines. Um, cooking with seafood is really, uh, really easy. I'm going to show you how to do this place dish, with, uh, which is great for the whole family. So we have tips of asparagus, parsley, uh, banana shallots, some spinach leaf, place, capers, a little bit of butter and cream. So when we're doing the asparagus, we just get rid of the woody bit. We just discard the, the woody bit. Then the tips of asparagus, we get them all to a nice even size. So we're going to drop um, the asparagus tips into boiling salted water, which would only take a couple of minutes. Once they're cooked, we we'll take them out, put them into uh, ice salted water to keep the flavour. Just going to add um, some chopped shallots, a little bit of white wine, a little bit of cream and butter, just so we get a nice rich flavour. So the shallots I'm just chopping fine, so you see I went up three quarters of the way through. Okay, just going to pick the stems again off the parsley, discard the, the stem, and just pull it all together. And again, I'm not wanting to stand and put all the flavour in. I'm just so nice and slowly all the way through in one in one go. And you can see the powder of of parsley. So if I take one out and we just check it on the board, just see if there's any resistance. So there's no resistance in that. So we take that out and I put that into the iced salty water. Okay, so I want to cool that down as quick as possible and then I'm, I'm going to drain that out in a couple of minutes. I take a knob of butter into the hot pan for the spinach. Just let that melt. And I'm going to add the spinach in. Okay. If there's long stems, you can take them off. But as I say, that the baby spinach is very tender. Okay. A little bit of salt. And we take a teaspoon of them. You can see how it just heats up the pan and it steams the spinach right away. Okay. So you can see how green it's staying up. It's not in a pan. It's, the pan's not too hot. Okay. Just going to take the spinach off. Onto a plate, just to get rid of the, the excess water. A little bit of olive oil into the pan. Now, when you're cooking fish, it's important that we don't have the pan too hot. Um, not like meat, whereas we're looking at meat, we're looking for it to be very, very hot. Okay, so I've just seasoned the fish both sides. And then I just put the fish in away from myself, so if there's any splashes, it goes away from me. And you'll see this will take roughly a minute, two minutes to cook. Okay, now I'm just going in. I'm just going to shake the pan slightly, just to remove it. Make sure it's not sticking. Flip that over. Nice golden colour, both sides. I'm just going to add a little more of butter, just so we have a little bit of nut flavour by the time the fish has kicked the nut flavour over through the, from the butter. I'm just going to drop my asparagus back in. 
I'm going to take my fish out once that cook. You can see how quickly that, that cooked for the fillets. A little nub of butter. Chopped shallots. And so again, all the fish flavour is still in the pan. See the shallots, so I'm just getting a little bit of the sugars, the natural sugars out for that. I'm going to add a little bit of white wine. I'm just going to add a just tablespoon of cream. Let that melt. Then I'm just going to add it with some butter. So I'm going to add another butter. While that's melting. I'm just going to take the asparagus out and I'm just going to put that into the pan that I had the spinach with a little bit of butter there. Finish off the seasoning. So I'm just going to turn that gas off. Okay. So you can see how rich and full of flavour that is, with a little bit of white wine. I just add the parsley, parsley minute, and I'm going to add a few capers. So when we're pressing the plate, put the spinach on the plate, and then the fish, I'm just going to put the smaller fillets underneath. And put the bigger fillets on top so I get a bit of height. Okay, asparagus I'm just going to build up. Okay, so if you wanted you could actually have some parmaham uh, with that. So I've just mixed it nice and light. Okay, and then I just dribble the sauce around. Okay. If you're serving it at home or for a party, it's probably better to put less on um, and then serve a little bit separate. Okay, obviously you can see the dish. Um, the dish is full of flavour, seafood's full, uh, packed full of flavour, multitude of health benefits, um, no matter what age um, or stage in your life you are. When you're, uh, it's, it's important that we all support um, buying UK uh, fish from the likes of our local supermarket Morrison's um, all, there is also a, a number of online retailers delivering fish boxes straight to your doors um, and if you're looking for any more information on www.fishisthedish.co.uk thanks for watching and enjoy your dish